Um, we both use easy catalog to pull data. Basically, the way it works, it looks for a data panel, your data, and the data I have here is a report coming out of Biblio, basically. What you then do is you create a template of how you want the catalog to look. You know, if I um, zoom in a bit here, so you can see that I'm after a work title, author, edition copy, and I want to do that for all the assets I have in my report. So basically, if I look at my panel, come on, play ball. I have different groups of editions. So I'm going to, for example, run those out into a catalog and you're going to see how quickly it will be done. It also will update like furniture data. So you can see I have two sections here. Currently, the picture book section is green. But once it goes to the young fiction section, it will change in color as well. So if I paginate that using my library here, you know, and I'm going to go down the page using my grid and to the next page, I just click the OK button. And there we go. It's paginating. And what right. maybe didn't come across uh, entirely in that that first uh, Word document that you showed off there, Goodwin. Yeah. Those, you know, baby blue uh, elements, those are actually URLs to either the PDF of the book, the watermarked PDF of the book, or a video file or anything. So being able to publish the assets to URLs has allowed us to distribute this content in really creative ways. So you can really, you know, what Goodrun's doing here, um, you know, you can set up a template and, you know, people can click on a cover and download the, the PDF. And so our, our rights team and our sales teams are, are leveraging MailChimp. They're, they're doing, a, using a lot of different tools to then feed that, that information out, which is outstanding. So if you think about it, it's still now 149 editions. So it basically created 19 pages of data and as you see young fiction has gone blue you know where the top ones still stayed green so you can control a lot with it which something like that would have got a marketing designer taking you know weeks to do wasn't it yeah. where now they're using our department to really create content like that and then use the marketing department to top and tail it so they add a cover to it and they add back matter to it, but they are able to create very customized, you know, um, catalogs for different, different usage. So you can have an edu educational catalog. You can have even an interactive catalog where we, we put URLs in there, download links that it automatically goes and finds if, if something is there, you know, on this specific one, you see that square icon, that means that they have an activity sheet. So, you know, it's an educational catalog. So they know if I have that little square in there, that there is an activity sheet for that edition in Biblio. Yeah. So that, you know, you can do a lot, you know, automating wise. This is probably a really important point that I think we over, overlook quite a bit, but by having a single location for this data yeah. across the group, you know, you've yeah. got Walker, Walker Books in, in two different locations and Candlewick. And by having one location for all of this data, we're not duplicating data. We're not feeding out inaccurate data. We know if there's a problem with the information, it comes from one place. You yeah. know, previously we would have, you know, just outside of our, our pub schedules and our production schedules, you know, we would have Excel grids all over the place, but we would have metadata all over the place and we would have cover images and something would end up on Amazon and you would go, well, how did that get there? Oh, I had it on this shared drive. I thought this was the final cover. But again, by, by turning and putting it all into this centralized system and then leveraging the data from that, you, you're 
cutting out the errors, you're cutting out the you know proofreading and copy editing that needs to happen because it's it's all in a, a single place and you're just leveraging it from there.